Hi and welcome to my next City Skylines Realistic Building Tutorial. I'm Ak Original and today I want to show you how to build natural lakes and forests. If you want to follow along, all the mods are linked in the description. So let's grab some buckets and trees and let's get started. So first we need a flat terrain. I already got it, so I don't need to flat it out. You would simply use the level terrain tool here. Grab the height with the right click and hold left mouse button to flat it out. So next up we got the height of the terrain here, which is 60 meters. And we set it to about 40 meters and hit enter. Maybe use a little bit of a smaller brush size and simply shape our lake. And now the lake would be a little bit flat, so maybe take another 20 off here to 20 meters. Don't forget to hit enter and add some deeper segments in the middle of the lake around here down to there but here yeah that's looking good and now we need to soften terrain tool and we simply move along the corners or the borders of the lake up we go to the water tools grab the water source and by default it's one so the lake is not that big maybe go down to about 0.3 yeah that should be fine and the rule here is the, the bigger the lake the higher you want the water capacity to be and if even 1.0 is not enough, then you have to place multiple water sources. Also make sure we are on pause, which we are. Go on the top down, that is the deepest part of the lake. We can check that simply with the terrain heights. See, that's the deepest part. Now let's place it here. And if we touch the lower part of it, we can move it around. We grab the highest part, we can adjust the height. Let's go for about there. And unpause. Set it to max speed and let the water fill in. Settled, we are going back into the landscaping tools and grab the sand, which I have changed to a more of a dirt texture since this is not a tropical setup. In a more tropical setup I would keep it sand, but this is more northern European or something. Make the brush a little bit bigger, yeah that seems fine, and now we move around just like that so that the dirt looks a little bit out of the water and 
And then you could leave it like that. If you like that effect that this looks like deeper water or not. But you also can just fill in the rest. I want to fill in the rest as well. Alright, now we got a pretty decent lake. Next up, add some trees. I got a forest brush called Mixed, which has all these new trees that came with the latest update. How are they called again? Um, content creator trees. So, the Life Oak, what's that? Horse Chestnut, some of the Pines, that kind of stuff. So, let's throw that in. we got the trees in. I think it's quite a decent mix. Of course if you want to go for a more tropic island style you, you use different trees. So now we need to find an empty spot to set up our granary that transitions between the lake and the forest. I like to grab some of that vegetation that comes with green cities I think. But if you don't have green cities, you can find a lot of greenery on the workshop. Just place it out like that, mix it up with different kinds. Like that here. A patch of that. Yeah, that should be fine. Now, the tall grass works great. I'll get a lot of these in. I'll also make sure the tree snapping is not on so it's not placing it on top it gets slightly floaty but we can fix it soon we'll move it. I will show you in a bit. So a few bushes here and there. Maybe even a little bit more of that grass. There, there. Just fill it nicely in. Uh, maybe even one of these bushes. Oh, no, no. Then that greenery. Here, there. You know, just go wild. M make it look wild. <laughs> there. Okay, I think that's good. Now we grab move it, the marquee tool, which is the second one here, and make sure we select it all. Go to object height, no, to terrain height. Good, now all the grass is right on the terrain. Now just select all again, hit control C, to copy it. And now let's find the lake. There is the lake. And now we fill that all in alongside the lake. Rotate it around a bit so it doesn't look copied at all. Also here and there leave some space where we can see some of the brown of the dirt. Yeah, like that. That's good. Just just fill it in. And there we go. A nice lake surrounded by greenery and forest. Of course you can go nuts with adding some rocks and decals and whatnot. So from here it's all up to you. That are just the basics. I hope this tutorial is of help for your own lakes and if you like it make sure to subscribe, like and leave a comment, that would help a lot. And I also want to give a shout out to Chameleon, the man in the middle of a lot of modding projects. If you check the workshop 
almost all mods have him listed as co-author, and he always is a huge help. So big thank you to you. And he also is a Twitch streamer, so check him out. The link is in the description. Until then, have a great day. I see you next time. Bye bye. Big. Big.